guys are so ready. I saw it. So earlier we saw a couple of makeup artists brushing their way to the finish, but your hair has to be on point too, right? Don't make no sense your face look good and your hair ain't working. So we've got two master hair stylists, Brittany Ray, who's Jamaican, she says, and Wayne Maxwell here to see who can come out on top in this mini competition. Guys, you don't have much time because this is what you can't do in a rush. Flush <laughs> in a rush. Are you ready? So, same process. Select your, select your look. Open them up and let's see. Dum dum dum. Wayne got <laughs> over the top. Can you see? And I'm struggling. Oh, still, it's trying to open the paper. Oh, this is gonna work out for you if you can't open the paper. Let me help you out. Ooh. Christmas party. Okay. All right, guys. I'm not gonna hold you up any longer. Your time starts now. All right. Let's see what we're doing. So all of that here is yours. Yeah. Am I your hairdresser? <laughs> Not yet. Oh, come just look at wonder because if you can make her hair look so long. Yeah. All right, so we've got it starting with a little bit of what moisturizer, hair oil? Yes. To protect? Um, to protect it. Uh -huh. So we add some argan oil mm -hmm. to moisturize the hair. All right, and give some heat protection. Okay. All right. Now, Wayne is no stranger to smile. He's been on smile like 50 times already, probably day along before me. And so he knows what he's doing on TV, but let's see if he knows what he's doing in the hair. I see all of these female clients go to Wayne and come out looking like, oh, Wayne did my hair. You know what? <laughs> so I guess something, it has something to do with a male stylist that in their hair. So his look, as we said, was over the top and he is on it like white on rice. Here we go. And let's check out our Jamaican stylist. Brittany Ray is over here doing some curls and swirls in our model's hair. What's going on, Brittany Ray? So we're going to do a more modern Hollywood road gram okay and right now i already prepped the hair we blow dried we put heat protect in we mm -hmm. did a nice smooth blowout and i'm just going in i just sprayed it with a little hairspray from redken mm -hmm. just to give it some hold and stay tuned and you're on the best all right is there any truth to saying using some products are better than others i feel like not using product is like not having safe sex oh jesus exactly <laughs> like you have to use products in your hair you're gonna get split ends you're gonna get damaged like i've never heard that comparison but i think everybody can understand <laughs> exactly like that. it's that serious you okay. know so definitely and do you have a choice in products i noticed that you said redkin is that your go-to um i love redkin i do love um a lot of different things i like oribe way so I'm I use a lot of different products I don't like to use the same thing because your clients their hair becomes resistant if you keep on using the same products in their hair so you got to switch it up all right got that let's check out Wayne and see what's happening over here Wayne what's your favorite product to use in natural female hair now I'm when I say natural I don't mean um, um, natural like mine I mean yes. natural that's growing out of her head not right me. so my my favorite product lines are Redken Mm -hmm. Of course. Um, Look like Redkin at the boss car. Everybody <laughs> about Redkin. Yeah, Redkin is a uh, very good and versatile hair line, hair product line. Right? So it has products for all different hair types. Okay? Mm -hmm. So that's one of my favorite products to use. Yes, okay. I also use Design Essentials. Okay. Right? I noticed that everybody's working curly and swirly out here. I don't, I don't see. I noticed that people are just popping curls. I don't see anybody making any styles. Do you think there is any any logic to the fact that some people say that male hairstylists are better than female hairstylists? Well, um, not necessarily, because it depends on how much work you put into your craft, um, how much training. So gender you, has nothing to do with it. It's just no, how it, much it work. It is it's how branding. well you apply yourself to your. Fantastic, I love that. <laughs> okay, so what are the plans in terms of the rest of our hair? I notice you're putting in swirls and curls and all these wonderful things. What's going to happen up top? Well, um, it's supposed to be like over the top. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, when I'm finished curling, I'm going to do some pin up. Yeah, so right. you want me to leave you alone because you don't want me to tell us your business. <laughs> Guys, literally you only have two minutes left. So I don't know what I'm going to plan to do, but I'm going to need to do it fast because all them curls and swirls and turls are going to take long. And the Christmas look over here, look almost exactly like the curls and twirls over here in the over the top, so I don't know exactly what's happening right here. This battle is becoming very look alike -ish. Let's see, the first thing both of them did was pick up, a, pick up a curling instrument. So I don't know exactly what's happening here, but we're still going. Dum 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 Benji, we still only have two minutes? Two minutes? Oh my goodness, we only have two minutes. 
Brittany, I know you have an event coming up. Would you like to tell me about that while you whistle and ride? Not okay. me, um, Gabby. Oh, you have the event. Oh, that's what's on your shirt. Glam 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 Con. Oh, Glam Con. your own goal. That's what I'm gonna see. <laughs> Mind your move, Ashabon. You know. Come in, Abel. <laughs> tell me a little bit about Glam Con. So it's a beauty expo slash conference. It's the first one that we're having in Kingston, Jamaica. It's going to be at Spanish Court Worthington, November 25th. Uh, we're having a special guest, a celebrity makeup artist who will be doing a masterclass. She's worked with Nicki Minaj and Cardi B and Migos. What's her name? Baby. Baby. She goes by Baby. She named Baby. Nobody yes. puts Baby She goes in by Baby. So actually Nobody. today we're having our launch at Mirror Mirror. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a shop and sip where you can purchase the tickets and receive a glass of wine. Oh, wonderful. And Mirror yes. Mirror is in which plaza? Central Plaza. Yes, guys, go in. It's in Central Plaza. I know yes. parking might be a little bit problematic in Central Plaza, but you can always park over Springs and walk around. Just don't tell them that you do. So you and can get your tickets to today. <laughs> and you can go and get your tickets for GlamCon. When is GlamCon? November 25th. And you can At just Spanish come and like, once you buy your ticket, you are eligible to just receive the full right. class. Right, so and we, have, we have two tickets, the Glam Queen and the Glam Girl. Okay. So the Glam Queen is where you're, you have access to the conference. You'll be a part of the masterclass. As well as we'll have a segment with some glam bosses such as Kerry and Clark, Cortia Bingham, Shanice Allen, and Wayne and Strong. Wonderful. That right. sounds amazing. So guys, in November 25th, that's next week, Sunday, Sunday at Spanish Court. At Spanish Spanish Court. Court. And guys, guess what? Your time up. But we're not going to be so disgusted and awful to you. We know that hair takes a little bit longer. So we're going to have you guys finish up the look offset and then we'll bring you back later and we'll show the final product. All right, guys. Master hairstylist is Brittany Ray and Wayne Maxwell. Yes, thank you so much for stopping by, guys. We're going to go for a little bit of a break and we'll be right back.